Hello, my name is Rebecca Cheng, the Liaison Adolescent Officer from Stretchers Youth Organization. I've been engaging adolescents and young people in Mombasa County uh, on sexual reproductive health to ensure that they make informed decisions about their sexuality. During this pandemic, uh, when these adolescents and young people are not uh, properly engaged, there might be increase of uh, sexual activities among them. Uh, therefore, it might lead to new HIV and STI infections and also increase in teenage pregnancies, which uh, might lead to girls making decisions of procuring unsafe abortions in our communities. <laughs> Sai tuko na hao watoto kabla hawajarudi mashuleni. Nitujaribu kuogea na wao vizuri. Kama ni wasichana muambie kwenda hapa hapa hivi kutangataka utachituka miba ya mapema na utafukuzwa chuleni. Na utakuwa mzazi of which age yako yako haijafika kuwa mzazi. As much as uh, coronavirus has brought a lot of hardship and difficulties in life, it has also changed the lifestyle of so many Kenyans and also around the world. And this has also brought an opportunity for parents and children to sit together and discuss on issues about their sexuality. Because through our projects, we have also learned that uh, we learned that parent-child communication was one of the hindrances or one of the factors that contributed to teenage pregnancy. So during this time, we are very optimistic that our parents and children are going to sit down so that they can be able to discuss on their sexuality issues so that it can improve the relationship between parents and child. Sa ile changamoto ile iko ni shida na watoto iko nyumbani kama mayana wasichana wale wakubwa iko hapa ndani ya nyumba tunasumbuliwana na wasasi kama msichana kumfom baba na ba mama alikuwa anasaidia apate hela ile anahitaji yote apate sahihi kuna baba iko nyumbani na mama iko nyumbani sasa lazima ataenda nje amtu adaganye alafu hata kesho atakuwa na mimba na atakuwa na shida nyingine as we are fighting this COVID-19, one thing that we have to remember that uh, I know people are stressed, there are a lot of anxiety, when will all this come to an end? My urge to parents back at home, I know you people are also stressed about loss of job and you staying at home. I think it is very high time also you create some good time and talk to your children because I know some of them are stressed because uh, I remember some who are planning to sit for the examination this year but now they are at home they don't understand what is happening so it is high time that you make children or young people back at home to understand what is this COVID-19 how is it transmitted how it can be, be prevented. Now that we have uh, the COVID-19 pandemic with us. Children are at home together with the parents. It presents a very perfect opportunity for parents, especially men, to engage with their children in um, comprehensive sexuality education. Recently we've had uh, cases of sexual gender-based violence increasing. I would like to urge men to protect our girls and women during this pandemic. We therefore call for actions that parents to take responsibility and talk to their children because they now have enough time.